Hi guys and welcome back to my vlog. Now this vlog was meant to be um, a hello world vlog kind of showing what went on at the event however I didn't get very much footage. I will explain to you why in a moment uh, but the footage I did get up at the end of the video so you can have a little look just little snippets from the probably the end show. Um, the reason for that is because excluding the end show which happened we got there at one and the end show happened at four o'clock so that bit of the day before the end show not a lot happened so that's why i've not got much footage so this video has kind of almost turned into a review of the event now i don't want to take anything away from the people that have organized this event it was a good event. I mean, there were clouds in the sky, there was sun, there were buildings. You could tell a lot of thought went into it. Um, but with like any new show, there are a lot of teething problems. And this one had had quite a bit. Um, it's it's kind of difficult. I like I I find it hard to give reviews like this because I maybe was expecting a bit too much because we queued to get in which you expect with any event you're going to queue to get in it's just part of the process but when we were in there i didn't expect to queue for four hours to not see anything so you had all the different stores you had like the library the main stage the school the bakery and the arcade games you had it all around the arena um so it was a really cool setup but my brother explained it perfectly it was like um, a theme park. So if you wanted to go on the rides, you had to queue for them. So we kind of came in expecting this, oh, wow, which we got. And then we suddenly realized, ah, oh, there are massive queues everywhere. We are now gonna spend the rest of the day queuing, which we did. Um, you did have a schedule, but the schedule wasn't kept to. So we didn't know what was happening where or when. So people would just randomly appear and we'd be in the wrong place and then there'd be a stampede across the arena and by the time we got there it either finished because it was a really quick thing or there were so many people that we couldn't see who it was or what was going or hear anything because that it would be like 50 people deep <laughs> and it's all on one level so mm, we didn't even get close to the bakery we got no cookies didn't see any cookery classes i was actually really excited about the how to vlog lesson you know i'm still learning my vlogs are still very new um didn't see that it could have happened i may have missed it but i didn't see that um we then queued to go into the library for about 30 minutes but it didn't move and that was because no one was in there but nobody let people know that there was no one in there so we just thought oh it's a slow queue and then we realised we weren't moving and there was no one in there. Whoever was in there had left. We then queued about an hour and 40-ish minutes to go into a different section. Now I'm not going to say what section because I don't think it's fair that there was a protest in the line. Because people had queued for about two hours. These were the people before us to get into this section but they had just missed the vloggers that were in there so they had left and these girls were devastated they said they'd waited two hours some of the girls had flown from Dublin they'd had similar experiences to us where they hadn't been able to see anybody else and and the main event was going to start after this this was towards the end of the day that they wouldn't have time to go to any of the other stalls so they kind of protested and said we're not going anywhere we're not going to go into the room or the, the section until somebody comes back. We want to meet someone. Now it's quite hard because the vloggers did make it clear. It's not really a meet and greet. It's like an interactive thing. But you, we almost felt cheated. Like we had waited so long. So um, the guards went down this massive line. God, there must have been like a hundred of us queuing. There were loads. And was like, anybody want to come in? Anybody want to come in? And everyone pretty much said no they said we'd rather queue and wait and you get somebody to come back because you know we've been stood there for so long and not done much else um nobody came back people still waited my brother and i still went into the section and loved it we met the most lovely lady in there um she was like part of the production of like different products and things and she was so nice so kind she made the day she was the only lady that we met she wasn't a vlogger 
she wasn't a celebrity but she was so nice she was so kind um yeah so that was my experience i met <laughs> somebody that helped produce products but yeah i really liked her um and then in the rest of the day there wasn't anything else to do we just we must have been in the wrong place at the wrong time meeting the wrong people because we queued that's what we did we queued or we stood around or we tried to see someone and couldn't and then we were like oh over there this tiny little figure way in the distance i think that's so and so and we couldn't tell and then we're like oh there's so and so over there we think and then a couple of times actually um a few people did pass us but you know we were queuing there was a barrier and then they were almost like hidden between two security guards and they were just kind of like as they went by if they had just stopped or just as they were walking by be like oh hi guys thanks for coming you know see you at one of the other stations it just gives you that like Oof. oh great oh yeah he seemed nice or she seemed nice but none of them did that they almost kind of hid behind the security guards which was a bit of shame so this whole this isn't our world this is your world my world doesn't consist of queuing for about three four hours not seeing anything and then get a backache <laughs> that's not my world no so yeah that was that was a bit of a shame but this show or this event has so much progression and like growth that it can go to it, it can be massive it can be the event of events to go to like the potential is there it could be phenomenal um like this could be great we came up with so many ideas while we were queuing just so many great ideas that they could do and we're like oh if they only did this and if they only did that um and we made a lot of friends because you know you're stood next to them for a long time um and they like came up with ideas and we we're like oh if they did that it would be amazing so yes it has potential so if you're going quite soon i would say just know where you want to go and head straight for it and just commit to the queues um if you're going i don't know if they are next year or the year after don't write it off from what i'm saying because it could be completely different this was its very first day so this is my personal view there could be some girls that went to the event and loved it they could have hit the right cues at the right time saw the right people i just didn't so i thought i'd explain why i didn't have much footage and kind of my experience of it um but yeah I hope you have enjoyed this video or my little rants um yes i'll insert the footage now please give a thumbs up if you have enjoyed this video or found it interesting and um and don't forget to subscribe either and then i'll see you all again soon bye oh. <laughs> social breakdown i know oh look there's the map there isn't very much happening right now. <laughs> Hang on. We've got 15 minutes oh. till the. Um... Let me just, you know, look at the newspaper. The newspaper. From the Hello World. What's happening today? Well, today <laughs> there is a how to vlog, which might help. <laughs> we need to get to that study area. Where's the. I don't know. I don't know. I mean, there might be someone famous in the future. The new Ed Sheeran. I just can't concentrate.
pizza joist? That'd be so cool if you got like multiple people like you know, joist and uh, play the game. Like, yeah. <laughs> Stampede! Okay. It's not in the game. Ingrid gone well. Last call. Cool. Love pitch perfect. Well, this is the cinema. This little strip. There must be more. Maybe they open it up. There must be more. Where do you go? Question for you. Oh my gosh. Would you like to talk everyone through your first kiss with Zoe? How did I know it was going to be related to Zoe? Because you're going out with her. Can I just say, time is going, mate. My first. Okay. Or what food option is it? Pig's tongue. You suck it. No, I know what it's going to okay, be. Okay, yeah, yeah. I'll explain the story. So we're running out of time now, we need an answer, otherwise okay. you're going to have to eat. So I'll set the scene, we're in, we're in a hotel. Oh, lovely, yeah. <laughs> Wait, Joe, you're getting way too excited about this. Jeez, I'm going to go backstage like, no, I'll be no. Oh, why? But I don't like hey, this. I, I, I think time's up, I think time's up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, it's too long. So I can't say, I have to eat. You have to go now or eat. It's landed on the pig's, pig's tongue. <laughs> Alfie! It landed on crickets. Okay, get, get. Two, three, in. Oh, no, no. no. Oh, I'm too pregnant for this. <laughs> no. I love this game. See that? Did anyone take a selfie with it? You did? Nice, I remember actually because, funny enough, is there, do you have pictures of the cows? The cows? The cow. Can we get them up? See there? See?
See you. 